Hey everybody and welcome back to Crafting with Coggins. Today is the Mother's Day edition. So for Mother's Day, we're gonna make napkin rings. I know a lot of you are not able to go out and buy Mother's Day presents, but all mothers love when their kids make them some gifts. So we're gonna do decoupage napkin rings. Okay, so here you can see the two different patterns. One pattern is very large next to the smaller polka dots. So you can mix patterns. You just need one pattern to be large and the other pattern to be small. And here I've cut the pieces of paper, but if you'd like a more shabby chic look, you can tear your paper. Another cute idea is newspaper or old music sheets. Here's the other things you'll need. Glue, toilet paper rolls, or napkin, paper napkin rolls, and possibly a ruler if you want to mark them off. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my ruler and I'm going to measure and mark off two inches. I'm going to make mine two inches, but if you want yours a little bit smaller, you can... Um, you can do one and a half inch maybe. Okay? So just like that, and then after you cut it, you might need to kind of reshape it a little bit. It'll come back into place, okay? All right, let's get started. So we have our pieces of paper. I've just, Sylvie and I have just cut them up into little squares or little pieces. Um, here's you on. So I just cut out a paper plate just to throw the glue on. So we'll just get some glue on here. And then we're gonna wanna do the inside of the um, paper roll first, work from the inside out. So um, we have paint brushes to paint the glue on and that's fine, but if you if you don't have one at home, just get a wet, wet paper towel and just kinda unfold it like this, just very damp, not really, really wet. You don't want it damp. I'm just gonna kind of wrap it around my finger like that. I mean, and it's Elmer's glue, so if you just decide to do it with your finger, that's fine. But So you can just kind of paint the glue on and then grab a piece. And it, it can be any which way. I think it's really cool if it's mixed up, but you can choose to do one in one color, another in another color, or you can make them all multicolor. It's whatever you want to do, okay? All right. Okay, so Sylvie's just putting a little bit of glue, and then she's going to put her piece in, and she's just bending it right over the edge. Okay, you see how she's just overlapping down in there, it doesn't matter any which way you like. Okay, so now you can see that I have all the inside done. I'm going to keep working on smoothing it out. And then you want to come around the edge too and just make sure you're overlapping on the edge. Alright, so after you've covered all over and you cannot see any of the cardboard, we're going to let these dry for a while and then we're going to come back and do one clear coat of glue. We're just going to go over it so it'll be nice and shiny. All right, everybody, how did yours turn out? I hope they're super cute. I know ours are. Um, just remember, once you have the paper down, you really wanna give it an extra coat so that the paper really adheres. And um, the extra coat will kind of give it a little bit of waterproofing on there. Um, but this is a really simple craft. It's just the paper towel tubes, any kind of scrap paper that you have and glue. And it's really cute. And I'll show you what it looks like on our table. So I hope everybody has a really great um, Mother's Day. And thanks for joining us for another episode of Crafting, Crafting with Coggins.